Hello, welcome to Tiny Prince Art Academy. In today's episode we will review Camel Artist Level Oil Pastels along with tutorial. Let's open this pack, I got this for Rs 490. It's a pack of 50 shades, the description on the box says it's brighter and smoother. This is chunk size, bigger than the student level pastels, let's try it out, this is student level pastel, I am using primary red, this is rich but quiet flaky. Now, I am using deep red from artist level pastels, it's more creamy and smooth in texture, which helps in easy application, and it is less flaky. I am using cerulean blue from students level and brilliant blue from artist level, artist level shades are more rich and deeper. Please follow on Facebook page and subscribe on YouTube channel in the name of Tiny Prince Art Academy and watch more interesting tutorials. Let us begin with our drawing tutorial, I am drawing a typical village scenery starting with a woman who is sitting in the front yard of the house, and she is stitching something. Now, I am starting a small house which is far away, a house with a veranda, and dried hay roof, a typical Indian rural house. Let us add a tree behind, I am adding some bushes around, which will separate sky and ground, finishing with a hen and a rooster. I am adding few more accents like a plate and a huge tree in the background. Let us begin coloring, I am starting with sky. I'm using brilliant blue first, color is really smooth followed by light pink, next comes orange, and lastly finishing sky with deep yellow. Dust out all fakes using old brush or just dab your book down. I am blending colors with my fingers, since colors are so creamy and smooth in texture, that blending is really awesome with this product. I am using brilliant blue, leaf green, light green and lastly lemon yellow.
For the roof of the house I am using yellow ochre, and blend it with burnt sienna, for walls I am using grey, adding black to it, and simply blend using fingers. For the entire house I will stick to the same color scheme. Use leaf green and lemon yellow for the bushes. I am applying flesh tint as skin color and all shadow work will go into burnt sienna. For woman sari border, I am using light violet as accent color, and sari will go in scarlet. Initially I am applying scarlet where I want deep shades and leaving white spaces which I will later blend with white pastel, this will give sari complete shaded effect. For hair I am using burnt sienna and top it up with black, blend it well, color hen and rooster with multicolors. For the cloth that this lady is holding, goes into light blue, with some crisscross lines in dark blue, for coloring ground use lemon yellow first, then add orange just next to the hen and rooster, finally add light green, blend all well, blending is literally hassle free with this product. Add brown for shadow effect, plate goes into brown as well, blend well, finally start coloring huge tree, branches go into yellow ochre, for leaves use brilliant blue followed by leaf green and blend all well.
Border picture if needed using sharp pencil, highlight if needed, add dark green for streaks of grass around. Village scenery is ready, if you like this episode then hit the like button and do share forward, follow on Facebook page and subscribe on YouTube channel for more such tutorials, thank you for watching, we'll see you with more such videos, bye for now.